it's important to recognize that people do have questions about the safety of these new vaccines for COVID-19 that are receiving emergency use authorization. And while it is absolutely true that the pace of the development of these vaccines since the beginning of this year when COVID first emerged is in fact record breaking. It's also really important to understand what's the same about the scientific evaluation of these vaccines and how we know about the safety and efficacy of these vaccines. For both of the vaccines, when the research trials began, they had pre-specified endpoints for safety and efficacy, and they had to hit those targets to prove a, a lack of major side effects, as well as prove their efficacy at limiting severe illness or death from COVID-19. So I'm very pleased to say that as a practicing emergency physician who saw patients with COVID, uh, I have received my COVID vaccination. I have confidence in the safety and efficacy of this vaccine. I have confidence in the systems that help us with the assurance of this. But when vaccinated, you still can have a low level infection uh, that may not even give you any symptoms. But what it means is that you can shed the virus, you can transmit the virus with that low level infection. And so until we have vaccinated enough of the Massachusetts community to be able to get to levels we call herd immunity, where transmission of the virus goes low, there's much less virus overall in the Commonwealth, we are going to need to continue to wear masks. We're gonna to continue to need to follow the public health restrictions that we've had in place this year. Um, I know people want to move past uh, what we've been doing. People want to get back to close to normal, uh, but we have to be in this together. We have to all continue to follow these restrictions, wear masks a while longer until we can get more people vaccinated. Then when we get there, when we get vaccination rates high enough, we'll be able to take off the masks and, and we will be able to start moving back towards normal.